Hey, what's going on? This is William Fulmer from my Strength Beads page. I haven't been on my Strength Beads page because I've been busy working on my YouTube page as well as my Kenta Films. But today I wanted to show you a couple things with Strength Beads that I have not stopped. First off, I have started adding labels and little baggies to my beads, which I just think it's cool. It's something I decided to do, you know, on my off time. And I just came up with that idea. I know it's not a new idea, but I thought it was a good idea. Uh, what I have is my stamp and, you know, the yin and yang symbol, which I think is cool. Uh, some of them I usually have the size of the bags wrote on there. But today, I want to show something about strength beads. And just wanted to give you an outlay on what to do with your beads when they get dry. I don't know if you can see that one. You can see how it's kind of dry. I'll hold it up. Your beads get old and dry when you wear them. And I want to show you what to do to these to bring them back. Now, some of them that I've already brought back are like these right here. Um, I'm going to do a second coat on those. You'll see what I'm talking about in a second. And I did the big ones, my big Shintos. I did those guys, you know, just recently, like last night, so I'm gonna redo these again. Um, I have a couple more that I wanna show you. Like those, those dried up. Uh, let me get another one. And these kind of dried up. So I'm gonna show you how to bring those back. If the camera will focus on them. How to bring them back. One of the best things you can use, if people don't pay it no attention, is mineral oil. Mineral oil will bring these boys back. So I'm gonna show you, um, not show you, but just do it. Put the bead in your hand, that a little bit of oil in there, and you take your beads and you rub them on the beads. Now, mind you, mineral oil is really good for your hands. It's baby, basically a thicker, thicker baby oil, but the minerals are really good for you. And as you can see, It'll bring a shine back to these, and these bad boys will look even better tomorrow because it'll soak in. See these right here? See how that looks right there? As soon as you wipe, see that? As soon as you put them in your hand, kind of rub them together, and somebody, you know, made a joke, say, oh, you're rubbing your balls. It's a set of fun. But as I'm saying, mineral oil will bring these back. They'll bring them back. So don't think, because you wear them so much that they'll be no good, It'll bring the color back and make them look even more beautiful. It's one thing, like these are a little bit different. You might have to add some more oil to these because these are a little thicker or a, like a light tan wood. And I'll just rub them together, you know, put them together like this, and then it'll bring them back. This will help preserve them. There you go. Isn't that neat? Same with the big ones. Do the same thing, you just rub the oil on the beads, that's all you do. Rub the oil, get the cracks, you know, get around the base of the, of the ball. Fuck y'all, I'm gonna talk shit. But get it around the ball, and it brings them back beautifully. Same with these. Oil them up, you get them real good. And just get around all the cracks of it. This will help preserve your strength beads, especially the brown ones. The color ones, I don't, I wouldn't do it on, but the brown ones are the most. If someone asked me, how did I keep my beads looking so good? I said, you know, I'm gonna do a little tutorial on it. So I hope this helps someone, and I hope you enjoy. And also, you can get Strength Beads for B. If you want to make an order, you can go to Facebook to, to Strength Beads and put an order in. And I do mail them. So, hey, hope this helps someone. Take care, guys. This is Will from Strength Beads.
Atitude 